Where am I? It's here. Okay, Theo. Okay. So here, sorry, Kirill, for the interruption because there is a sudden power interruption in our place. The electric just turned out without notice. Yeah. I don't see anything. You don't see anything for a while. Wait, I say when the electric, I can hear, see, but I say when the electric turn off, I yeah. can see. Yeah, because there is a power interruption that the electricity turns out, turns off without any notice that there is electricity. And then it also gets back for a few minutes for only three minutes. Okay, so let us continue. How many scores did you have? Please count. One, seven hundred and five. Okay, seven hundred five. Oh. But one thousand seven hundred five. But what may I say when do you come in Vietnam? Okay, so when everything will be okay, Theo, I will go there. But I will find uh but I will find uh what's that? Please, I mean uh, I will find a way in which I can send you something, right? So I will just ask you. Uh, yeah, of course. Because of course the pandemic is nowadays it's very uh it's not uh easy to to travel nowadays. How about in Vietnam? What happened in Vietnam? Are you still wearing a mask? The virus is come back. Wow, very good. In the Philippines, a lot of virus is coming here. I don't know why. I don't know why a lot of virus in the Philippines. Okay. So we have here for questions 21 to 25. Okay, look at this one. Okay, for 21 and 25, you have here, this is a good thing because the questions are here. So just answer 21, 22, just encircle the letter. Okay.
Okay, John Fisher, a builder, and his wife, Elizabeth, wanted more living space. So, they leave their small flat for an old 40-meter-high castle tower. They have spent five years turning it into a beautiful home with six floors, winning three architectural prizes. I love the space and being private. Elizabeth says, you feel separated from the world. If I'm in the kitchen, which is 25 meters above the ground floor, and the doorbell rings, I don't have to answer it because visitors can see I'm in. There are 142 steps to the top. So if I go up and down five or six times a day, it's a very good exercise. But having to carry heavy things to the top is terrible. So I never buy more than two bags of shopping from the supermarket at a time. Apart from that, it's a brilliant place to live. When we first saw the place, I asked my father, father's advice about buying it because we couldn't decide. After paying for it, we were a bit worried because it looked awful. We really love it. We knew how we wanted it to look. Living here can be very difficult. Yesterday, I climbed a four-meter ladder to clean the windows. But when you stand on the roof, you can see all the way out to the sea on a clear day. And that's a wonderful experience. I'm really glad we moved. Okay. So the N21. What is the writer trying to do in the text? A. Describe how to turn an old tower into a house. B. Recommend a particular builder or letter C. Describe what it is like to live in a tower. Okay, I think. Yeah, very good. Number 22. From this text, a reader can find out why visitors are not welcome at John and Elizabeth house, why Elizabeth exercises every day, why Elizabeth asks her father to buy the tower, or why John and Elizabeth left their flat. Why? Do you think it's letter A? Are you sure with your answer? I think letter C. Okay. It's letter C. Oh, let's C. See. Okay, letter C is your answer? Yeah. Oh, it's letter D. Why John and Elizabeth left their flat? Okay, one point. Okay, next, 23. This is the last activity, Kyo. Please erase. Okay. Okay. Oh, did you read it properly? <laughs> okay, did you I read it? Read, I just oh, 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 you remember. Okay, let's try. You've got two points. Which I'll just try. Okay, I just I know. try to remember it. Yeah, I know you're very smart. Which of the following best describes Elizabeth? Again, which of the following best describes Elizabeth? I Elizabeth Tower feelings about the tower. She wanted it as soon as she saw it. She liked most things about it. She has been worried since they paid for it, or she finds it unsuitable. I just has that just my answer is she has been worried since they paid for it. Which of the following best describe Elizabeth's feelings about the tower? She, is she worried? I see. I think she not worried. Oh, I think she's not worried. So what do you think is the answer? Hmm. Okay. 
Okay, I just I. Okay. <coughs> That is my answer. <coughs> okay, let's see. Let's see. Can you have other option? Please speak to. The other option of mine is B. Oh, B. Wait. Okay, A and B. Go. Okay, letter A twenty three. It's A and B. The answer is letter B. She liked most things about it. Okay, three correct. points. You're correct. Number 24. What problem does Elizabeth have? What problem does Elizabeth have with living in, a, in such a tall building? What is the problem? Living in a tall building is very hard. What do you think is a problem? Her visitors find it difficult to see if she is at home, letter B, she feels separated from other people. Letter C, she cannot bring home lots of shopping at once. Okay. Or it is impossible to clean any of the windows. Okay. Do you think your answer is correct? Yes. Okay. Because please, I don't know. Okay. Please try to look up. Because it's already in the third floor. It's very high. So, what do you think? Can you pick one more answer? Okay, I just... I... Okay, her visitors find it difficult to say. Uh, are you sure? When you go up there, it's very... It's very... The building is very tall. So, you don't need to bring a lot of things. So, what do you think is the answer? What do you think? A, B, C. Oh, only I need I need to pick two only. Please try to pick two, not A, B, C. Okay. A and C. A and C. Okay. A and C. Okay. Very good. I told you she cannot bring home lots of shopping bag. Of course, because it's very the building is very tall and if you go there and you will have to find a new home i mean uh you will find uh you will find uh a new uh you will buy a lot of things of course it's very it's very hard for you because the building is very tall of course okay it's plus good. okay plus four okay Okay. okay. Okay, how much is the score now? How many? 1,709. Very good. 1,709. Okay. So for now, okay, we are only after this. Okay. We are, wait, we're 26. I will note here. Wait for a while. 26 uh, and uh, wait for you. 1,104. Reading 26 to 35. Okay. So good job, Kayo, for tonight. You've got 1,709. Oh, so many now. Okay. My God, it's so many. So now, teacher Anne will say goodbye and I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Okay. Kayo, do you have other Hi. questions? You have questions? No. You understand? You just understand? Yes. Okay, for now, bye, Kayo. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Okay, of course.